Dr. Alton, I'm here to brief you on your daughter's MRI and CAT scan. Mm -hmm. Alton has a special gene code that is very rare. In fact, a medical neurological team led by Dr. Rudolph Tanzi of the Massachusetts General Hospital is studying the gene code. The pituitary gland produces a protein called beta amyloid, which can be built up on the brain neutron as a plaque, which leads to Alzheimer's. Allison's gland produces the opposite effect. She has the ability to remember every second in her life. She has photographic memory, uh, short term and long term. She has instant recall and possibly ESP. Actually, central perception? Yes. Further tests can confirm her behavior. May I have your permission to report our result to Dr. Candy's team in Boston? You have a very special girl here. I'm just going to ask you random questions and random subjects that just pop into my mind. You ready? Okay. Who was Stan Wadey? A Cherokee general, the only Native American general for the South in the Civil War. Let's talk math. What is four-thirds times pi times r3? It's the formula for the volume of the sphere. What is base 1 plus base 2 times height divided by 2? It is the formula for the area of a trapezoid. What do you know about the Statue of Liberty? It was designed by Frederick Bartholdi and was a gift from France de dedicated on October 28, 1896 by President Grover Cleveland. How did the statue get to America? It was brought over on 10 ships headed by the flagship is here captained by Desaulnay. The flotilla arrived in New York Harbor on June 17, 1885. How long is the statue's nose? 4 foot 6 inches or 1.48 meters. How much does the statue weigh? With or without the pedestal? Without. 450,000 pounds or 204.1 metric tons. Where is the is here now? On June 23rd, 1917, she was on a voyage from Barrie to Oregon, Marseille, when a German U-boat submarine, the U-39, fired its torpedo and sunk is here 70 miles west of Cape Sparta. There were no casualties and the survivors were picked up an hour and a half later after the attack by the French fishing trawler Ashwan Aeroposto. Dr. May, there is something on my mind. An asteroid called the AG-5 was discovered by Mount Limon astronomers in T Tucson, Arizona in January 2011. It's on a collision course with Earth and will hit us in 2040. There is a scientific team from the United Nations in Vienna, Austria led by Dr. DeShazza, trying to figure out how to stop it. As of right now, no one knows what to do. No one has any answer. Are there any other doomsday dangers heading our way that we can't solve? Yes, many. Well, my plane is leaving soon. We need to talk again. My pleasure. <laughs>